was started in 1950 by my grandfather. I'm third generation owner. We're located in Brooklyn, New York, and we're about 2,000 square feet. We converted to ACE about a year and a half ago. The thought process was we felt that we had plateaued with our former co-op. Uh, where we were becoming stagnant. Our sales were becoming stagnant. We didn't have the brand recognition that we knew Ace had. And so we knew we had to make a change if we wanted to further develop our business. Obviously, it's an emotional decision. It's a hard decision. We were with our former co-op for close to 40 years. So in essence, it's, it's like a divorce. I mean, you're, you're leaving something that you've been with that you're used to, and you're starting all over again. New people, new faces, new procedures. And, and it is a tough decision. But uh, when we decided to finally make the plunge and convert, uh, there were no doubts in our mind that we had made the right decision. This was our first conversion, so I wasn't too sure what to expect. And I have to say, I, I was really pleasantly surprised by how the process went. I mean, Ace really brought in a, a good team of people that helped us through the process. We, we had the right contacts in case we did have issues. After we converted, every metric that you could basically use to measure your store sales have increased. Sales were up 10% last year. Average ticket, which I didn't expect to see an increase in, that one kind of surprised me, but we saw an increase of over a dollar in our average ticket as well. Where we saw the big difference was bringing in new customers. We have a lot of people that are constantly moving in and out of this, uh, this neighborhood. I mean, we're an urban environment, constantly have transition here. So I think the Ace brand lent a lot of credibility to our store for those people moving in and out of the neighborhood so that they knew where to go to get a consistent service experience and quality product. The Ace brand recognition is just phenomenal. I mean, you can't sit through uh, watching TV without seeing an Ace commercial or an Ace ad somewhere or hearing it on the radio somewhere. And the net recognition is out there. So it's a great feeling to have that pride in the co-op that you're a part of. One of the misconceptions about Ace was that they're not flexible, that they're going to strong arm you into bringing in certain products and certain categories. And we found that to be completely untrue. As the store owner, you have the complete autonomy to do whatever you want to do as far as bringing in those products. I think uh, what Ace does is they really encourage you to be a better retailer uh, by participating in different training and programs. And we don't see any reason why we're not going to continue to grow at the rate that we're growing now. And we're really confident that our business is going to go to new levels. I would put the ACE management team up against anyone in the industry. I think they're second to none. They want to make sure that they continue to be the front runner in this industry. And it makes us proud. I mean, they're really proud to be an ACE dealer. I think looking back, the only regret we have is not making the decision sooner. Your cost of goods will go down with ACE. The uh, name recognition will be there. So it really is just a mental decision that you have to make, that you have to be comfortable with personally. I received a phone call from our former co-op and telling me I was making an emotional decision. And I had a very simple answer to that. I said, the emotional decision would be staying with the co-op I've been with for 40 years. The smart business decision is to move on to Ace and transition our stores over. I thought uh, that pretty much sums it up. It feels great, yeah, it feels absolutely great. We're very happy to be with Ace.